Good luck and fair seas. Good luck and fair seas. Warte auf Anweisungen. Ende. No! It is balanced. It is like Zorki or Yamagiri or something, a balanced super ship. Potato. It's it's a straight upgrade, it's better. But it's better how it should be for a T11 ship, kind of. The only problem is since Condi and Annapolis exist and United States and Eagle, it is kind of trash. Yeah, I agree. But it's still a great ship. Like, it's still a good ship. It's an upgrade. It does a lot of things better. But at the same time, if you compare it, of course, to Condi and Cla Annapolis, it's, it's garbage. I agree. But that's only because those two and the two Super CVs are busted be over any point. We don't gotta argue about that. But if you look straight at the ship from H to Hindi to this, it's an upgrade. And it's a good upgrade. The plane submarine warfare alone is already like a big yes for me. And the radar feels so much more responsive, which is also great. So, if I would have the verdict on it, I would say yes, it's a good ship. If you don't compare it to Condi or Annapolis. Radar's whole 0 0.3 better, it just, but it feels so much better. Probably because... Probably because I built it into the extra rudder shift, that's why, the 20%, that's probably why. Then again, why don't I have the 20% on my Hindi? I should do that. And maybe it's also because the ship doesn't lose as, as, as much speed when turning. So I guess it has the Marseille effect, where you just feel the ship is so responsive, but... Yeah, what can I say? It just feels so nice, it doesn't look speed or something too much. And there, Arty Buck again, beautiful. Look at look at this garbage. Seriously, get that back. It's disgusting. Like the fact that I can't do this. It's just disgust. Look at. <laughs> this delay is atrocious. Hey, killer Jedi, by the way. Like, I want the railgun butt back back. That was at least not influenced the battle. People were like, eh, screeching about it, but it had no input, did, uh, no real impact on the game. This has. We have to do something in a split second? Oh no, it's not working. <clears throat> it's disgusting. It's really disgusting, honestly. Like, I have to do like this and wait and wait. Okay, now you can shoot, Tremors. Now you're not gonna miss. Now you're allowed to shoot, Mr. Trenless. You won't miss. And I'm like, thank you. It just took me like two seconds. Hmm. 
Well, yeah, they can do something good. It's the game. I still love it. Not to mention that they're really good when it comes to having cool events. Okay, AP it is. Oh, let's go! Gimme, gimme, gimme more broadside, boys. Gimme, gimme, gimme more broadside, boys. This is a great time to test the turtle back, by the way, because I think this ship has turtle back or should have it. I can so they should be not able to sit on me now. Ooh. Oh, buddy. Nope, it's holding. Very good. We're just gonna torp you already because, well, he's pushing into us anyway. Let's go, we triggered Lutians. Woohoo! Seven and a half second reload. Let's go! Broadside to him as well. Little back should still hold. As long as I don't lift my citadel too much. Good turtle back is holding. Will it hold here as well? Let's see. Mm, you got through there, okay. I mean it's not impossible, it's just helping at close range. You gotta remember that part. But my DPM is absolutely gonna melt him now, so that's nice. Classic German torpedo tubes, oh yes. They never change. That's the Fletcher. Ich brauche Aufklärung. So yeah, all in all, it's a nice ship. It's it's great upgrade from the Hindi, but Again, you should no, never compare it to Condi or Annapolis for D2 Super CVs. Then you're just getting sad. But that's not the thing. This this ship is exactly how a super ship should look like. It's better than this counterpart, but not like absolutely crazily better. Although it, it is a pretty decent upgrade, I gotta say, from my point, honestly. But yeah, this is how super ship should be, you know? This is why I think Zorki and Yamagiri are kind of like good ships as well, because they are upgraded versions of their ship. But they're not, like, utterly busted like certain other ships. Oh man, this might hurt, my friend. Okay, the CV and Yama can shoot the Fletcher. I'll finish off the Jombard. Mr. Napoli thinks he can be mean to me. I see. I'm gonna angle against him. And I mean 12 kind of York guns are great. And the 60mm deck armor can save you against certain plunging fire, uh, not plunging fire, certain fire 
on your superstructure in the middle from time to time. So that's also nice. Now to Mr. Fletcher. I'm ready for him. What's the smoke fine penalty? 10.6. What is Hindi's? Close to 10, right? Hindi's is not much better, right? I don't have the numbers right now. But I feel that Hindi has a bit of Venetia syndrome. So it's quite trash for the caliber. Oh well, they will force a potato if it ever happens, that's for sure. 10.2, yeah, so it's not much worse, it's like 10.6. Mm. Oh well. Nice try, buddy. But I knew you will eventually torp me. Ooh, nice. Citadeling in Napoli at 13.5. Four. That means the extra pen is there as well. That's good. I like it. I like it. Did he launch both sets? No, only one, right? Okay, we gotta be careful here then. He's gone. <sighs> That's giving me a super clip already. <laughs> Dude, clip could be easily the 11 as well if they. Change like only like buffing the reload by like 10% or something, it would be already enough. Those were the Fletcher Torps. Let's go. Hello, buddy. Accepting your fate. Oh. I just realized one critical mistake. He did single Torp earlier, so of course he had one set ready. He kind of debated me here. That was a good move. I totally forgot that he single launched. And when he launched the second time, of course, his first set is ready again. So there's that. Well, I'm still gonna get you though. <laughs> Bye. Ow. No crack, unfortunately. Hey, Lexbox, welcome. You live. You have been here not for a long time. How how have you been, my friend? How have you been, my friend? That's a super heavy. What's the gimmick? It's a bit more tanky. Uh, has a bit better firepower, and that's pretty much it. And it has plane anti-submarine warfare, which is like huge. But yeah, it's a great ship. It's it's fun. It's good. As long as you don't compare it to some other ships, like overall, it's a nice upgrade. New user, thank you. I should stay hydrated. Yes, my friend, I will. <clears throat> I see, bro. Stay safe and healthy, my friend. Good. Let's try the Lana now. Nice.